Hey brewers and brew lovers, welcome back to the garage. Uh, quick, just instructions on setting your Inkbird um, ITC. This one's an ITC 2000. The procedure is basically the same for the 1000 series as well. Uh, once you've got it wired up and uh, contained in an, an an enclosure um, hold in the power button to turn it on uh, it's currently 48.3 degrees inside my cooler um, and what you will need to do is hold in the S button for set for three seconds and it's gonna bring up uh, TS is for temperature set. Uh, there, this will also allow you to either heat or cool. Um, some of the other ones have separate hookups for uh, a hot or for a heater and the cold so that um, it can just switch to whichever one you need. Um, this one just has one power out so you actually have to change the mode in inside the controller so i blabbed long enough that we have to hold in the set button again once ts shows up then we can scroll through uh, i went past it we're gonna go to the hc which is for hot or cold and then you hit the set button and H for heat or C for cool, but we want to keep it on heat. So once that's selected, then hit set again. It brings us back to the menu and then we can go back to the temperature set. And right now this is at 80. I want to crank this up to 90 degrees. So we're going to go up to 90 and then we're going to hit the set button again so that that stops flashing and that means that it's set and so now if we hit the power button that's going to bring us back to the regular display and so this heat light came on so it's trying to heat up inside there so um, again Hold in the set button and then go to what you want and hit the set button again and see it remembered 90 and so we want to save that. Went through it again just because I need to see stuff a couple times before it sinks in but hopefully this helps. These are great little units they're like less than 20 bucks and um i liked just puttering with stripping the wires and stuff to to get it set up um for this so uh it, if you want to do that um i'll have a link to these on amazon down below and yeah go make good beer brew up an adventure